Welcome to the Crypto 101 course. To get started, imagine a world where you have complete control over your money, where you can send funds to anyone, anywhere, at any time, without the need for banks or middlemen. This is the promise of cryptocurrencies. Cryptocurrencies are revolutionizing finance, breaking down barriers, offering financial opportunities to the unbanked, and providing features like decentralization, security, and transparency that were unimaginable before. They've even birthed decentralized finance, offering lending, borrowing, and trading without involving traditional banks. Are you wondering what was the first crypto ever? It was Bitcoin. Introduced in 2009 by the mysterious Satoshi Nakamoto, it is the pioneering cryptocurrency that sparked a digital revolution. It laid the foundation for thousands of cryptocurrencies and transformed the way we perceive and use money. You might be amazed to know that in March 2024, Bitcoin hit an all-time high. It crossed $70,000. Are you getting excited to learn more about the crypto space? Let's dive into the basics of crypto wallets and exchanges, explore mining, and discover the art of trading, along with the risks and considerations linked with crypto assets. Firstly, what exactly is cryptocurrency? Think of cryptocurrency as a kind of digital gold, but with a modern twist. It's a form of digital or virtual currency that uses encryption techniques to regulate the creation of new units and secure transactions. And here's the kicker, it's decentralized. That means there's no central authority, like a bank or government, pulling the strings. Another way to understand cryptocurrency is to say that with cryptocurrency, you become your bank. Transactions occur directly between users, cutting out the middleman. Imagine sending money to a friend on the other side of the world without a bank or payment service getting involved. That's the magic of crypto. Now, what about its possibilities? The beauty of cryptocurrency lies in its versatility. You can use it to make online purchases, invest, or even store value, just like you would with physical gold. Plus, it's borderless, you can send it anywhere in the world instantly. But wait, how does it all work? Well, it's all thanks to the blockchain, a digital ledger that records every single transaction. It's like an open book, but it's tamper-proof and transparent. Once a transaction is on the blockchain, it's there for everyone to see. Confused between blockchain and cryptocurrency? Let's clear up the difference between the two right away. Think of blockchain as the unsung hero of the crypto world. It's a decentralized, transparent, and tamper-proof digital ledger that records every transaction made with a cryptocurrency. Now, talking about cryptocurrency, it is a form of digital or virtual currency that uses blockchain as its foundation. It's like the digital cash of the future. It's generally said that blockchain and cryptocurrency make the perfect team, but how? While cryptocurrency is a form of digital or virtual currency, blockchain is the technology that makes it all possible. Cryptocurrency relies on blockchain to exist and function. Blockchain ensures the security, transparency, and immutability of cryptocurrency transactions. Now comes the question, how does cryptocurrency work? The first step is creating a transaction request. Suppose you're sending digital coins or tokens to someone. It all starts with a transaction request. The sender, also known as the payer, uses their cryptocurrency wallet, which is like a digital version of a physical wallet. They provide the recipient's wallet address, the amount to send, and any transaction fees. The second step is the transaction being broadcast on the peer-to-peer -peer network. Imagine a massive, decentralized network, like a digital web of computers. This is the blockchain, the heart of cryptocurrency. The sender's transaction request is sent out to this network where many nodes, computers, work together. The third step involves validation by authorized nodes. Sounds complex? It's not as complex as you think. Within this network, some nodes have special authority. They check if the sender has enough funds, if the transaction is unique, if it follows cryptocurrency rules, and if the recipient's address is accurate. If everything checks out, they move the transaction forward. The fourth step involves combining and creating a block. Now, the validated transaction joins a pool with other transactions. All these transactions are bundled into a new block. This block can hold thousands of transactions from different users. 
The fifth step is adding to the blockchain, and this is where the magic happens. Once the block is complete, it's added to the existing blockchain. The transaction is now recorded in a block, and it's considered confirmed. Is there something else remaining? Yes, the very last thing. After getting all the confirmations, the transaction is officially completed. The recipient receives the requested amount, and everyone's happy. Mission accomplished. As we are discussing crypto, let's not forget to break down its pros and cons. First of all, let's talk about the positive side of cryptocurrency, starting with Decentralization, cryptocurrency operates without a central authority like banks or governments. It's all about financial freedom. Number two is security. The blockchain technology behind crypto makes it highly secure and resistant to fraud. Moving on to speed and efficiency, transactions happen faster and often with lower fees compared to traditional banking. Really? Yes, you heard that right. Coming to accessibility, cryptocurrency is borderless, allowing anyone with an internet connection to participate. All you need to have is an internet connection. Isn't it so easy? Are there any other advantages? Yes, it's investment potential. Some cryptos, like Bitcoin, Ethereum, and others, have seen mind-blowing gains, making them attractive investment options. Moving on, let's discuss the pitfalls associated with cryptocurrency. The first and foremost drawback is volatility. Cryptos can be incredibly volatile, with prices skyrocketing or crashing in a short time. Second is the lack of regulation. The absence of regulation can lead to scams and illegal activities. The next setback is irreversible transaction. Once a crypto transaction is confirmed, it's irreversible. Mistakes can be costly. So beware, my friends. Limited acceptance is another major drawback linked to cryptocurrency. Not all merchants and businesses accept cryptocurrency, limiting its use. Technical barriers are yet another item on the list. Understanding and managing crypto wallets and private keys can be challenging for newcomers. Also, what might be the applications of cryptocurrencies? They are Digital payments. Think of cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin as digital wallets that let you send money to anyone, anywhere in the world, with just a few clicks. No banks, no borders, it's like having a global piggy bank. Cross-border expeditions, tired of slow and expensive international money transfers? Crypto speed things up, reduce fees, and let you send money globally in a flash. Smart contracts, ever wish contracts could execute themselves? With Ethereum smart contracts, you can. These are like magical agreements that follow the rules you set, automating tasks from paying rent to managing supply chains. Opportunities are endless. Decentralized finance, DeFi. Imagine a world where you can lend and borrow money, trade assets, and earn interest, all without traditional banks. That's the exciting world of DeFi. Next, we have non-fungible tokens, NFTs. NFTs are like digital certificates of authenticity. Artists, musicians, and even gamers use them to prove ownership of unique creations. You can own a piece of the digital art world. Now, let's dive into some popular cryptocurrencies, beginning with none other than the crypto pioneer itself, Bitcoin. As already discussed before, back in 2009, an enigmatic figure known as Satoshi Nakamoto introduced Bitcoin to the world. It is known to be the world's first decentralized digital currency. This cryptocurrency has lit the spark for thousands of other cryptos, each with its own superpowers. It's not just a currency, it's a global phenomenon that's reshaping finance, sparking debates, and even earning the title of digital gold. Undoubtedly, Bitcoin gets all the headlines when people talk about cryptocurrencies, but there are literally thousands of other options when it comes to these digital currencies. If you want to know more about Bitcoin, you can explore our comprehensive Bitcoin 101 course. To know more, check out the link in the description below. After Bitcoin, we have Ethereum. Ethereum has played a vital role in expanding blockchain technology, offering faster transactions, enhanced efficiency, and whatnot. It has given birth to the concepts of smart contracts, decentralized apps, decentralized finance, and non-fungible tokens. Ethereum's native cryptocurrency is Ether, ETH. It's not just a coin, it's the fuel that keeps the Ethereum engine running. 
From transaction fees to powering those awesome decentralized applications, ETH is the heart of Ethereum. And guess what? Ether is by far the second largest digital currency after Bitcoin, making waves and shaping the future of blockchain. Thirdly, we have Tether, USDT, which was launched back in 2014. USDT's mission is to keep its value rock steady by tying it to traditional currencies like the good old US dollar. It isn't like other cryptocurrencies. Its value stays steady even when the market is uncertain, making it a safe choice when things are unpredictable. But that's not all, USDT is like a crypto bridge, connecting our digital realm with the world of traditional finance. It's the glue that keeps the crypto and fiat world seamlessly trading and transferring value. Next, we have the Binance coin, also known as BNB, which was launched in 2017. It is one of the biggest crypto exchanges at present. We can use BNB to pay for our discounted trading fees on its native platform, Binance Exchange, or to get in on hot token sales through the Binance Launchpad. And that's not all, BNB offers staking, where you can earn cool rewards. With Binance popularity, low fees, and a ton of services, BNB has become a popular choice in the crypto world, securing a top spot in market capitalization. Moving on to Solana, another popular cryptocurrency that we can't skip. Launched in 2020, Solana boasts lightning fast speed and scalability, making it a top choice for dApps and DeFi projects. SOL isn't just a token, it's the fuel that powers the Solana network. From transactions to staking and governance, it's the key to unlocking Solana's full potential. Let's head towards another interesting topic, crypto exchanges. You can consider crypto exchanges as your digital crypto marketplace, where you can buy, sell, or trade cryptocurrencies of your choice. These exchanges play matchmakers, connecting buyers with sellers and making sure those crypto transactions happen seamlessly. Thus, it can be said that they are a gateway to the exciting world of digital assets. Now, let's talk about some of the popular crypto exchanges. Beginning with Binance. Welcome to Binance, your ultimate destination for all things crypto. It's a bustling marketplace where you can trade a wide variety of cryptocurrencies, including Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, and many more. But wait, Binance isn't just about trading, it has its own cryptocurrency called Binance Coin, BNB. Think of it as your golden ticket to access special perks on the platform, like paying for trading commissions and unlocking various services. Next, we have Coinbase. Coinbase is a household name in the crypto realm, having millions of members across 100 plus countries. It's a crypto exchange that's made a massive mark in the industry. With Coinbase, you can easily buy, sell, and trade cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, and more. You can call it your crypto playground. One standout feature of Coinbase is its user-friendly interface. It's a breeze for newcomers to get started in the world of crypto. Another point that you shouldn't miss about this exchange is its security. They've also got your back with robust features like two-factor authentication and insurance for your stored cryptocurrencies. The next popular one is Bybit. Introduced in March 2018, Bybit has become a popular crypto exchange, providing a wide range of customized services and product solutions for both retail and institutional investors. Bybit's mission focuses on creating a safe, reliable, and transparent trading environment, empowering investors to navigate the dynamic world of crypto seamlessly. Another well-established and highly reputable cryptocurrency exchange platform is Kraken. With a user-friendly interface and a wide range of supported cryptocurrencies, it's a go-to destination for both beginners and seasoned traders. One of Kraken's key features is its strong commitment to security, employing cutting-edge measures like two-factor authentication and cold storage for digital assets. Despite occasional service hiccups during peak trading times, Kraken remains a trusted choice for crypto enthusiasts worldwide. The last exchange on our list is Bitfinex. Bitfinex is a Hong Kong-based cryptocurrency exchange that's been a major player since 2012. It offers trading in various cryptocurrencies, including Bitcoin and Ethereum, and has a reputation for its advanced trading platform featuring margin trading, lending, and derivatives trading. 
It's a favorite among professional traders who appreciate the platform's trading tools and charting options. Bitfinex also provides a mobile app for trading, and its high-speed trading engine is ideal for those who demand quick execution and high liquidity. Despite past controversies, like a hack in 2016, Bitfinex has improved its security with multi-signature wallets and a bug bounty program. It might be a go-to exchange for experienced traders, but remember to exercise caution and do your research when trading in the crypto world. The next topic that we will discuss is crypto wallets. Imagine a digital wallet that holds the keys to your cryptocurrency kingdom. These keys are like your secret codes to access and manage your digital assets. Just as your physical wallet stores cash and cards, a cryptocurrency wallet keeps your digital wealth secure. But it's not just about storage, these wallets have come a long way. Back in the early days of cryptocurrency, sending funds meant dealing with lengthy keys, but not anymore. Modern wallets have revolutionized the game, making cryptocurrency transactions as easy as a few clicks. There are various types of crypto wallets. First of all, let's talk about paper wallets. It is a physical document that contains a public address for receiving cryptocurrency and a private key for spending or transferring funds. They are entirely offline, making them secure from online threats. What about its flaws? If the paper gets wet or burnt, you will not be able to read your private key and the representative crypto will be lost forever. It's not so cool, is it? Next, we have hardware wallets. They are physical devices that store your cryptocurrency offline. Another way to understand such wallets is to say that such wallets store private keys on a hardware device, such as a USB drive. They are considered secure because they allow their users to safely store their private keys offline. Ledger Nano S and Trezor are some of the popular hardware wallets. Next on the list are software wallets. These are applications or software programs that you can install on your computer or smartphone. They are convenient for everyday use, but may be less secure than hardware wallets. Software wallets can further be categorized into three categories, web wallets, mobile wallets, and desktop wallets. Let's discuss them. Third-party providers host web wallets on the internet. They are accessible from any device with an internet connection. While convenient, they are less secure as your private keys are stored on the provider's server. Examples of this type include MetaMask and Coinbase. Mobile wallets are apps designed for smartphones and tablets. They offer the convenience of on-the-go access to your cryptocurrencies, but may have some security trade-offs. Coinomi and Mycelium are examples of this type of wallet. Desktop wallets are software programs installed on your computer. They provide a higher level of security compared to web or mobile wallets, as your private keys are stored locally. Exodus, Bitcoin Core, and Electrum are some of the popular wallets of this type. Here, please note that whether you're a seasoned pro or a curious beginner, a thorough understanding of crypto exchanges and crypto wallets is crucial to remaining secure in the volatile world of digital currencies. Going ahead, let's delve into another interesting topic, and that is how to invest in cryptocurrency. The first and foremost step is to get educated. Begin your crypto adventure by learning about this innovative technology. Understand how blockchain works, explore various cryptocurrencies, and don't forget to stay updated with the latest trends. The second crucial step is to define your goals before diving in. Ask yourself, are you in it for the long term, are you looking for short term gains, or are you just interested in trading? The third step is to choose a trusted and reputable crypto exchange. Make sure the exchange supports the cryptocurrencies you want to invest in. The next step is to create your account on the chosen crypto exchange. Be prepared for KYC verification, where you'll provide personal information and identity documents to comply with regulations. Be very careful, my friends. Another crucial step is to secure your digital assets. Get a cryptocurrency wallet to do so. Research and select your crypto wallet wisely. Remember, never leave your assets on an exchange for too long. Don't ignore safety at any cost. The next step is to deposit funds into your exchange account through bank transfers, credit or debit cards, or other accepted methods. Do what suits you the best. This is a recommendation rather than a step. Consider investing a modest amount that you can afford to lose. Cryptocurrency markets can be quite volatile. 
And don't forget to spread your risk by not putting all your funds into a single cryptocurrency. Remember that diversification can be a smart strategy. Now that you have already stepped in, you are ready to place your orders with the help of a crypto exchange. You can go for market orders, buying at current prices, or set specific prices with limit orders. This is not the end. The next step involves enabling two-factor authentication, 2FA, on your exchange account and wallet for added protection. Guard your private keys and login details. Lastly, record transactions. Maintain transaction records, including dates, amounts, and fees. This documentation may be necessary for tax purposes. And yes, my friends, you are good to go. One more important thing is to understand the tax rules regarding cryptocurrency in your area. Cryptocurrency transactions can have tax consequences, so ensure compliance. Now that you're equipped with these steps, you're ready to begin your cryptocurrency investment journey. The next topic that we will cover is crypto's price dynamics, also known as the factors that determine the price of a cryptocurrency. Buckle up, because understanding these factors is like holding the key to a treasure chest. The first factor on the list is supply and demand. Picture this, when everyone wants a piece of the crypto pie and there's only a limited supply, prices skyrocket. But when demand slumps and there's a surplus, prices drop. The cryptocurrency roller coaster reacts to news and events faster than a speedster. Good news, like widespread adoption, sends prices to the moon, while bad news, like regulations or hacks, can plunge them into a bottomless pit. We also have to be wary of market sentiment because the crypto market is like a moody teenager. When everyone's excited about a specific digital asset, let's say Bitcoin's future, prices soar. But when doubt creeps in, demand drops, and prices follow suit. Market patterns and trends can be uncovered through the use of price and volume data, and that's where technical analysis steps in. Crypto prices can be affected when traders and investors employ technical analysis to decide when to purchase and sell the digital currency. Regulations imposed by governments and regulatory bodies can also have a significant impact on the price of cryptocurrency. For instance, when a country gives Bitcoin the green light, legalizes it, everyone suddenly wants to buy it. More people buying means higher prices, simple math, right? If a government says, no more Bitcoin, the demand declines, taking the price down with it. Now, can you guess what majorly affects the cryptocurrency price? Yes, exactly. The official government statements regarding crypto adoption and regulation. Until now, we have learned about the fundamentals of cryptocurrencies, popular cryptocurrencies and crypto exchanges, crypto wallets, and even how to buy cryptocurrencies. Next, we will explore crypto mining, one of the most pivotal and interesting topics in the world of cryptocurrencies. So, mining is the process of adding blocks to the blockchain ledger, which serves as a public record of all transactions. The blockchain is maintained by a network of nodes that validate and propagate transactions. Here's where miners step onto the stage and play a crucial role in fortifying the network and reaping the rewards for their efforts. Let's understand how we can mine cryptocurrencies. Step 1. Get the right hardware. Mining requires specialized hardware, such as ASICs, application-specific integrated circuits, or GPUs, graphics processing units, depending on the cryptocurrency you want to mine. Ensure your hardware is energy efficient, as mining can be power-hungry. Step 2. Choose your cryptocurrency. Decide which cryptocurrency you want to mine. There are thousands of options to choose from. But wait, each cryptocurrency may require specific hardware and mining software, so choose accordingly. Step 3. Set up a wallet. You'll need a cryptocurrency wallet to store the coins you mine. So ensure it's compatible with the crypto you're mining. Step 4. Join a mining pool. While solo mining is possible, it's highly competitive. So what's the other option? Joining a mining pool allows you to combine your computing power with others and share rewards. Isn't that cool? But wait, don't forget to research and choose a reputable mining pool. Step 5. Download mining software. Next, you need to download and install mining software compatible with your hardware and the chosen cryptocurrency. Some of the popular mining software options that you may consider are CG Miner, BFG Miner, and NiceHash. 
Step 6. Configure mining settings. Configure the mining software with details provided by your mining pool, including the pool's address and your wallet address. Don't forget to adjust settings like intensity and temperature limits to optimize mining performance. Step 7. Start mining. Launch the mining software to begin the mining process. Your hardware will solve complex mathematical puzzles to validate transactions and add them to the blockchain. Step 8. Monitor and maintain. When all this is done, keep an eye on your mining operations performance, temperatures, and power consumption. Perform regular maintenance, such as cleaning hardware and updating software. Step 9. Here comes the exciting phase, receiving rewards. As your mining hardware successfully validates transactions, you will earn cryptocurrency rewards. Typically, the mining pool will distribute these rewards in proportion to your computing power. Now, here are a couple of pro tips. Firstly, periodically withdraw your mined coins from your wallet for security. Secondly, implement strong security measures to protect your wallet and mining equipment. Do you want to know what determines the profitability of crypto mining? These factors help you make the right moves, dodge pitfalls, and secure your crypto asset. So, gear up, miner. Learning this stuff is your ticket to crypto riches. Electricity costs, this is a major player in your profitability game. Imagine mining in a place with cheap electricity costs, you'd be raking in profits. But in regions with sky-high bills, it'll be a different story. Cryptocurrency prices, here's where the market magic happens. When your mined crypto's price is soaring, you're in for a treat. But if it has taken a nosedive, you have to brace yourself for lower profits. Mining hardware, pick your tools wisely. The hardware you use can make or break your profits. As tasks get tougher, you need the big guns, but they come with a hefty price tag. So, keep upgrading for peak performance. Mining difficulty, the difficulty of mining is a measure of how difficult it is to solve the mathematical equations required to mine a block. It's like a never-ending puzzle. The more miners join the party, the tougher it gets to solve those crypto puzzles. And with higher difficulty, solo miners might find it hard to stay profitable. In the exciting world of crypto mining, profitability is the name of the game. But remember, it's a journey with ups and downs. With careful planning and the right strategy, you can navigate the twists and turns of crypto profitability. But hold on, there's a twist. These factors are like a merry-go-round, always evolving and changing. That's why crypto mining is a high-risk game. Before diving in, miners need to be knowledgeable about calculating their initial costs and monthly expenses, setting realistic revenue expectations, finding their break-even point and ROI, planning an exit strategy if things go wrong. Now that we have also covered crypto mining, let's break down the potential pitfalls that come with cryptocurrencies and arm ourselves with knowledge on how to deal with them. Starting with volatility, cryptocurrencies are known for their price volatility. Prices can fluctuate dramatically over short periods, leading to significant gains or losses for investors. We all hate uncertainties in life, and regulatory uncertainty might just be one of them. The regulatory environment for cryptocurrencies varies from country to country and is still evolving. Changes in regulations can impact the legality and use of cryptocurrencies. Dangerous, right? Security concerns are another form of predicament altogether. Cryptocurrencies are digital assets, and the risk of hacking, fraud, and theft is prevalent. You must take measures to secure your wallets and accounts. A major pitfall is a lack of consumer protection. Unlike traditional financial systems, cryptocurrencies offer limited recourse for users in case of disputes, fraud, or accidental transactions. Moving on to market manipulation, cryptocurrency markets can be susceptible to manipulation. Really? Yes. This is due to their relatively small size compared to traditional financial markets. Sad, but true. Another setback is a lack of understanding. Many people enter the cryptocurrency space without fully understanding the technology or the risks involved, which can lead to mistakes and losses. So be cautious, my friends. Knowledge is a weapon you must have in your crypto army. Then we have investment scams. The lack of regulation in some regions has given rise to fraudulent investment schemes and scams, preying on unsuspecting investors. 
As discussed before, cryptocurrency prices are often influenced by market sentiment, news, and social media, leading to rapid and irrational price movements. Good news hypes the prices, while bad news brings crypto prices down. On number 9 is loss of private keys. What if you lose access to your private keys or wallet? Beware again. If this happens, you can permanently lose access to your digital currency holdings. What about the tax implications associated with cryptocurrencies? Taxation of cryptocurrencies varies by jurisdiction and can be complex, leading to potential tax liabilities for users. This legal uncertainty can leave users and investors scratching their heads, wondering about the risks they might face based on their location. Let's not forget about the environmental concerns. Some cryptocurrencies, like Bitcoin, require significant energy consumption for mining, leading to environmental concerns such as increased carbon emissions, energy wastage, and strain on local power resources. Cryptocurrencies are game changers, and despite these risks, they have the potential to revolutionize finance and beyond. Now that we have covered the head-to-toe of cryptocurrency, let's talk about enhancing its security and resilience. The cornerstone of cryptocurrency security is the protection of private keys. Yes, you heard it right. These keys grant access to your digital assets. Thus, you must safeguard your private keys by using hardware wallets, secure storage solutions, and best practices like not sharing keys with anyone or storing them online. To add another layer of security to cryptocurrency accounts, implement multi-factor authentication, MFA, in short. It typically involves something you know, a password, and something you have, a mobile device, to verify your identity. It's super simple and doesn't even take too much of your time. Next, we have regular software updates. Keeping cryptocurrency software and wallets up to date is essential. Thanks to developers who often release updates to patch security vulnerabilities. Are you aware of phishing? Phishing attacks involve tricking users into revealing their private keys or sensitive information through fake websites, emails, etc. So stay informed and don't fall into a trap where you might have to reveal your personal information. Another one is crypto exchange security. If you use cryptocurrency exchanges, don't forget to choose reputable platforms with strong security measures. Ensure they offer features like cold storage for user funds and two-factor authentication. This one goes without saying. Use secure and private networks when accessing your cryptocurrency accounts. Say a big no to public Wi-Fi networks. Diversify your investments. Avoid putting all your cryptocurrency holdings in one place. Stay informed, keep up with the latest cybersecurity threats and trends to stay ahead of potential risks. Prepare for unexpected events by having backup plans in place. Create backup copies of important information and private keys, and consider creating a recovery plan in case of loss or theft. Be resilient against market volatility. While not directly related to security, being prepared for market fluctuations is crucial. Avoid overinvesting and manage risks wisely. Lastly, legal and regulatory compliance. It is always advisable to stay informed about crypto regulations in your region. But why so? Any benefits? Yes, of course. Complying with legal requirements is part of enhancing security and resilience. So, are you now ready to make the crypto space safer and more resilient together? If you made it here, then you must really care about the world of cryptocurrencies. That's why we're glad to see another enthusiast stepping into this up and coming space. Are you also interested in knowing more about cryptocurrencies and their underlying technology, blockchain, and detail, or perhaps topics such as AI and Web3? Head on over to our website at www.blockchaincouncil.org to find a plethora of tech-related courses and enroll in one that grabs your fancy. Also, you can simply reach out to us at hello at blockchaincouncil.org for any queries. That's all for now, folks. See you soon.